Hello everybody, this is Michael Agene here and I want to welcome you to your DFY Hero dashboard. Okay, so in this short video, I want to show you the important bits you need to get started with your DFY Hero account. Okay, so now that you are logged into your dashboard, the first thing you want to do is check under the tutorials tab. Okay, under the tutorials tab, you will see all the videos you need, all the detailed tutorials or training videos you need to maximize the use of DFY Hero. Okay, please, I want you to take your time, watch each of these videos before you get started with creating your websites. Okay, and, and then the second thing you want to take note is this. Okay, right now you can see my name dot dfy hero dot com right i believe that you want to get a custom domain name so the first thing you want to do is to go under your account and don't get me wrong it is totally fine completely okay if you want to use our subdomain but if you want to, to have a customized website for yourself or for your business of course you are building a brand for yourself right so you want to go over to the custom domain get on here add your domain uh, point it to our IP address or create a C name to our DFY Hero account. I mean .com domain name, and then you you have a custom domain under our server. Mind you, you will still be hosted under our server, but you are you you have your own custom domain name. Okay, we're gonna create a more detailed training on how to create a custom domain with DFY Hero, okay? But now uh, you can see your access level here. You have, uh, forget about the fact that this is free. It just means that you have an unlimited lifetime account, all right? So you can see under your, under after you visit the tutorials tab, like I said, make sure you watch all the training videos and then your account to change your custom domain. And then you go back to your DFY Hero dashboard and then you visit my site, okay? Now, the first site you will see, because you haven't built any site yet, you will see the first site you created while your, your account was being set up. So you can go visit the dashboard or visit the site to customize it as you like. But now I presume you would want to add more sites to your site, to your, to, your, to your account, right? So you can go under add new account or add new site where you can pick any template of your choice. So right now we have a whole lot of categories you can pick your templates from. So if, for instance, I want to build a corporate website, I can go under the corporate category and then I pick any of the templates that are available for you here, okay? Let's say I want to pick this template or I just want to view them before I select them. So I will right click and then, um, let me see, I'll just view this template right now. If I like it, of course, I'm just going to pick it. Uh, let's wait for it to load up a bit. Uh, okay, okay, I think it's loading up. All right, so look at the template right here, guys. This is beautiful, okay? So if I like this template, I like how it looks, and I want to use it for my business, I can just come here and say use this template. Just click this tab, and then you go to the next step. We're going to get a more detailed video on how to go about this, all right? So now you can pick any of those templates, you can select it and then start customizing your brand new site. All right, so all the details, all these tabs here, you shouldn't be bothered at, at all about them. We're going to get into more details in the next videos. All right, guys, welcome again, and I'm super excited that you are here with us.